and guys, it's Presley, and today in this video, I'm going to be talking about my first time experiencing a solar eclipse. And let me tell you, that solar eclipse was amazing. The solar eclipse, if you guys don't know, happened on April 8th, 2024. The last time I heard about a solar eclipse was when I was a freshman in high school, and it was like 2017, but I'd never actually experienced a solar eclipse before. So on that day, on April 8th, um, it was like a life changer, a game changer for me to experience something as cool as a solar eclipse. So my mom and I were out in the backyard when this whole event happened. We got our own special glasses, like paper thin glasses, um, only used for like solar eclipses and stuff like that. When I looked at them, they kind of reminded me of those paper thin 3D glasses of one side is blue and one side, the other side is red, but this is completely different. These are special solar eclipse glasses that can only help you see whenever the solar eclipse is, like, um, is appearing and stuff like that. Um, and when I put them on, I couldn't see Jack. I couldn't see anything. But I, all, I can only see the solar eclipse with those glasses on. And when the solar eclipse happened, I put those glasses on and I looked up in the sky and I said, Whoa, holy shit. This is so cool. <laughs> that, it, and it was really cool. Um, when I saw it, it was like a sliver of the sun being blocked by the moon. And it was amazing. It was like anything I've ever seen before. The last time I saw something as cool as the solar eclipse is back in 2020. It was late at night and my dad took me outside, out in the front, out the, my front yard. And I saw this giant star. And um, apparently I looked it up and it said um, Jupiter and Saturn like collide to make the Christmas star or something like that. It was like around December when I saw it. This was like four years ago in 2020. And that was amazing. But seeing the solar eclipse was just as amazing as seeing that giant star I saw four years ago. And then everything went dark for a good four minutes. It was very slow. It was slow and tedious. And by the time it happened, all my neighbors were screaming, Woo! Yeah! <laughs> I can see why a lot of people were screaming because a lot of people came, came here in Texas just to see the solar eclipse, like people from different states, people from even different countries even. But by the time before the solar eclipse happened, on April 8th, it was like, it started off as a cloudy day. Like, I thought the solar eclipse was never going to happen. And I could only imagine how pissed people were going to be. They would just show up on the weekend just so they could see the solar eclipse. And on that day, it was just be, it was just going to be cloudy. Damn. They would be so mad and so frustrated. But as soon as the solar eclipse started, all the clouds parted just so we can see the solar eclipse. And th thank God. God, because I would have been mad too. Seeing the solar eclipse is one like one of those lifetime opportun like one once in a lifetime opportunities. Well, I heard the next solar eclipse will be in like twenty years, but I don't know if I'm gonna be alive in twenty years. I might be forty, but who knows? I don't know if I'll be alive in the next twenty years. So seeing the solar eclipse for the first time, I had to see it. Because not a whole lot of people got to see it. My mom was excited. My little brother was excited. A lot of people in my family were excited to see it. Some people didn't get to see it, and that's okay because they broadcast it on TV, which it's not the greatest. It's not as better as seeing it in real life, but it's the next best thing you got if you don't, if you can't see the solar eclipse. But that's okay. I mean, if you can't see anything as good, as what you got, I guess TV works. That's okay. Besides, there's always next year, not next year, next 20 years. If anyone will be alive during that time, who knows? Anyway, I just wanted to say that the solar eclipse was amazing. And let me know on your thoughts on the solar eclipse. What did you guys think about it? And um, what were your thoughts by the time going to that place to see the solar eclipse and blah, 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 and all that stuff? Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, comment, share, subscribe, all that jazz. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.